What's going on, Dylan Conrad, Metabolic AF? I'm gonna talk to you about Ladies Steal This Fat Loss Meal Prep Hack. Before I get into that, if you're watching on YouTube, please like, subscribe, turn notifications on Spotify, iTunes, hit that bell button, leave a review. I'll help the algorithm. So, meal prep hack. If you guys didn't know this, it's an actual stat, human beings actually eat the same five to 10 meals every single week. Research-based, you eat pretty much the same five or 10 meals, right? So how can we turn that into a fat loss hack? Simplest way to lose fat, you wanna stay in a calorie deficit. To stay in a calorie deficit, you don't wanna be hungry all the time, so you wanna increase your protein and also make sure you don't lose any muscle, right? Kind of connective tissue, stuff like that. So to do that, you need to just take the meals that you eat you can like sit down and just kind of like, I just like, I'd basically go through your a couple days and write down like what you ate. Okay, I had lasagna. Okay, I had pizza. I had, cause you can make a healthy version of pizza. You can make a healthy version of a lasagna. If you don't believe me, DM me or go on Instagram, DM me at Dylan A. Conrad, healthy swap cookbook. Um, and I'll get you, I think I have like over a hundred recipes of like, lower calorie, higher protein swaps for literally every single meal, like chicken nuggets, like you name it. And basically you just wanna really increase the protein and decrease the calories, typically by adding a little bit more volume in terms of like the, um, the vegetables, if you have any fruit in there, just to lower the calories and actually keep you satiated and full. But it's literally like the simplest meal prep hack because I think we always think, oh, I need to like sit down like a bodybuilder every single Sunday and prep on my whole week. It's like, no, bodybuilders can do that. Some people can do it. Some people it's sustainable for it. We actually have clients that actually do do that. But for most people, it's not gonna be realistic. It's not gonna be sustainable. Maybe one week they can't do it long-term. So the best thing to do is, is actually not physically meal prep, but mentally meal prep. Know what you're gonna eat. And a great mental meal prep hack you can also use is what's called pre-logging. Now we have a lot of our clients do this, especially in the beginning of using macros, because you're kind of trying to figure out like the protein, carbs, and fats and how to like navigate through your whole day. So we'll have clients literally put everything they're gonna eat the day of or the night before for that next day, um, what they're gonna eat and like modify it to their specific macros. That way they can line everything. It's much easier that way. So um, if you want my healthy swap uh, cookbook, Go on Instagram, DM me at Dylan A. Conrad, Healthy Swap Cookbook. Um, and then, yeah, I would just honestly moderate your day or if you can, if you know what you kind of eat already, write it all down and you can just be like, okay, how can I make a lower calorie version and higher protein? And you could literally usually just Google them for recipes too. Pretty simple, ask chat GPT um, and you should be good to go. Anyways, I hope this helps. Um, if it did, please like, subscribe, turn notifications on. Um, love you all. Enjoy the rest of your week.